All right. Oh, I have to press start. I always forget. Also, it's not very obvious what button is the start button on the on the controller of the Xbox. Just saying. Resume. Why does that have to take 50 years? All right. I don't know what our mission objective is right now, but glad to see you're okay, Commander. Commander, I'm glad to see you're okay. Losing Whoa, how are you? The crew and I'm glad we didn't lose you too. What does that say? Wieners die? That's what it looks like, but I can't see. We'll talk later. Things were pretty rough down there. Yeah, you never get used to seeing dead civilians. Doesn't seem right somehow. But at least you stop Saren from wiping out the whole colony. I couldn't have done it without you. We're Marines. We stick together. And I'm just sorry that we lost Jenkins. Yeah, I wish I could have done something to save him. I was there. Your outrageous cheekbones right. could have done something. It's just bad luck. It's been a hell of a shakedown, Cruz. Our first mission ends with one Spectre killing another. The Citadel Council is not going to be happy about that. Probably use it to lever concessions out of the Alliance. You've got a good grasp of the situation. You a career man? Yeah, a lot of biotics are. We're not restricted, but we sure don't go undocumented. We may as well get a paycheck for it. Besides, my father served. I made him proud when I enlisted. Eventually. But is that why you're here? Because of your family? Ugh! My family were homesteaders on Mindwar. I'm the only one left. But I've moved beyond that. Oh, that's right, the Blitz. I imagine that bought you any posts in the fleet. Uh. Because we're heading for the Citadel, ma'am. Can you, uh, tell me why? The Captain hopes the Ambassador can get an audience with the Council. Tell them what Saren's been up to. Makes sense. They'd probably like to know he's not working for them anymore. <laughs> Whatever happens, we'll be ready, Commander. We are all very calm about this. Paragon plus two. What the heck does that mean? Did I just get, like, approval? In the paragonal sense? <laughs> wow. This is the slowest elevator. I think the only one that compares is the one in, uh... Oh god, what is it? Dragon Age Inquisition, uh... The, the, the one where you go into the Dwarven Ruins? I can't think of the name. But it's the DLC. Okay, well... I'm not really interested in that right now. Okay, maybe I am. I don't know. Oh, it got me experience points for whatever reason. Hey, Commander. Looking for some extra supplies before you head out? What have you got? Whatever you want. Armor, weapons, mods. It's not standard Alliance issue, but that's not necessarily a bad thing. This well, is like black market? Don't mind paying for it. Wow! Why should I pay you for my weapons and armor? My stuff doesn't come from the Alliance. I have to purchase it myself, and it's not cheap. Hell, the licenses alone have set me back more than I'd like. But no licenses, no goods. Without the goods, I'm out of a job. Let's see what you've got. You bet, Commander. Alright. Oh, I don't remember what kind of armor I'm supposed to wear. Excuse me. Oh, okay. Sorry, my dog is like, hey, now's the time. No, now is not the time. <laughs> what has you assault rifle? That doesn't look like a rifle, that looks like a med kit. Oh, up, up. Oh. 
Okay, how much money do I have? Are you even going to show me that? Oh, I see up at the top in those big, bright, glean, glean? Bright green, I almost said letters. What's the matter with me? Bright green numbers. It's the dog's fault. Okay. Um. No, I just want... I just, I just want, okay. Oh, sell, I don't want to sell. <laughs> I just wanted, just wanted something of my own. You don't have to whisper at this point. <laughs> okay, sorry, sister. What can you do? You know what? I'm I'm I don't even understand most of this. Shame about Jenkins, Commander. Is that it? Shame about Jenkins. Yep. It really did like a big zoom in for that. You've got a hat. Cool. <laughs> Another thing for the codex I'll never read. Is that it? What? How do you start missions? Oh. I don't know. You think I know how to do anything here? Sure. Oh! Well, we want to keep that on her. Okay, you have fun with the new weapon I gave you that I don't know what it does. I am the best shepherd. Welcome to my happy flock. Anyone know what that's from? Well, not the exact line, but... It's a seed where... In Advent Children, Final Fantasy VII, where Kadaj is like... In the English version, oh, it's such a weird translation. He's talking to Cloud and he's like, You could have been part of our happy flock, or something like that. He's, he's like, but you are a black sheep. <laughs> and Cloud's looking at him like, what the hell are you talking about? That guy was very blonde. Timing, Commander. I was just about to bring us into the Citadel. See that taxpayer money at work. I have a feeling I'm never gonna change anyone's armor. Or if I do, I'm just gonna make it worse. sizes and everything. Why so touchy, Joker? I'm just saying you need firepower too. Oh my god. We'd be blatant. Look at that monster. Its main gun could rip through the barriers on any ship in the Alliance fleet. Good thing is on our side then. Citadel Control, this is SSV Normandy requesting permission to land. Stand by for clearance, Normandy. Clearance granted. You may begin your approach. Hi, Arbiter. To an Alliance operator. Roger, Alliance Tower. Why does everyone have bad teeth? Dragon Age, I understood it. They're back in like... 
400 AD. <laughs> I'm kidding. But... Jeez. The Normandy. What was that? Did you just brand our ship? This is an outrage! The uh -oh. Council would step in if the Geth attacked a Turian colony? The Turians don't found colonies on the borders of the Terminus systems, Ambassador. Humanity was well aware of the risks when you went into the Traverse. What about Seren? You can't just ignore a rogue specter. I demand action! You don't get to make demands of the Council, Ambassador. Dang! Citadel Security is investigating your charges against Seren. We will discuss the CSEC findings at the hearing, not before. Who are these chodes? Captain Anderson, I see you brought half your crew with you. Just the ground team from Eden Prime. In case you had any questions. Oh, that I is Ashley. Mission reports. I assume they're accurate? They are. Sounds like you convinced the Council to give us an audience. They were not happy about it. Seren's their top agent. They don't like him being accused of treason. I'm not gonna sit on my ass just because the council doesn't want to do anything. If they won't stop Saren, I will. Settle down, Commander. You've already done more than enough to jeopardize your candidacy for the Spectres. <laughs> the mission on Eden Prime was a chance to prove you could get the job done. Instead, Nihilus ended up dead and the beacon was destroyed. That His Saren's mouth is very hurts. weird. Then we better hope the CSEC investigation turns up evidence to support our accusations. Otherwise, the Council might use this as an excuse to keep you out of the Spectres. Come with me, Captain. I want to go Come. over a few things before the hearing. What kind of accent Shepard, is that? You and the others can meet us at the Citadel Tower, top level. I'll make sure you have clearance to get in. And that's why I hate politicians. Obviously. Dude, I am... This is not gonna go well. <laughs> I'm bad at maps to begin with. I'm even worse at radar maps. Is that me and my little dot? Are you gonna jump? No. Of course you're not. Where are we? It looks like a hotel. A futuristic hotel. Oh, jeez. I hit B! I'm never gonna get that right. Alright, well. Thanks for trying. Come on, guys. No, you're gonna- Oh! Apparently we gotta go this way. Do I have to hold B? I think I've asked myself that before and just haven't done it. Cortana? Is that you? Greetings and welcome to the Presidium. My name is Avina, and I am pleased to be your virtual guide throughout this level of the Citadel Space Station. I don't need a guide. Our records indicate this is your first time on the Citadel. A brief orientation session is customary. Please allow me to do my job. Are you real? Fine. So are you a person or a program? I am a fully interactive virtual intelligence. Programmed to provide spontaneous guidance at predetermined locations of interest throughout this level of the Citadel. I may also be contacted through any of the Presidium VI terminals, should you require assistance. Fine, thank tour. you. You are standing at Presidium Tourism Terminal 1. On either side of this lobby are the embassies of the various Citadel races, along with CSEC headquarters. On the far end of this level, you can see the Citadel Tower, where the Council meets regularly to discuss matters of interstellar importance. I want to know more about Citadel security. Citadel security Just in case we have to break out of here. For all regions of the Citadel. Though the majority of officers serve in the wards. Executor Palin, a Turian, is the current head of CSEC, but individuals from virtually every species across Citadel space serve as officers beneath him. 
If you wish to learn more, Executor Palin's office Ow. is located in the CSEC headquarters just across the lobby. I just popped my... Oh boy. What can you tell me about my the ankle. Citadel Council? Originally, the council consisted of representatives from the Asari and Salarians, the two dominant species in Citadel space. Oh. Roughly 1,304 galactic standard years ago, Turians were invited to join the council in recognition <laughs> That's a of the long time. during the Krogan Rebellion. Since then, the three council races have worked together to ensure the peaceful coexistence of the galactic community while preserving individual autonomy for each species. Yeah. It can't be as simple as that. There must be problems somewhere in the system. I am not programmed to make that kind of qualified judgment. My code is limited to information and simple interaction simulations. Well, you're no Goodbye. Cortana. Goodbye, and thank you for using Avena. Please enjoy your visit to the Citadel. You can't? Oh, you can. You can't travel at all with these terminals. You are stuck here. Wait. There's a thing. Are you the thing? No. Neither of you are the thing. And though I see an axe. Are you the axe? Oh, you're the axe. Jeez Louise. All right. Directions? No, just take me there. Sure, take me to the tower. I think I wrote an article for Mass Effect 3? Oh, and if you were wondering what Amy wanted, she was going to get me some noodles from uh, some place. I forgot. I want to say Noodles and Company, but it's not Noodles and Company. That was the second option, and her boyfriend picked the f first option. But uh, I had an IBS attack this morning, so nothing, nothing for me. Thanks. Saren's hiding something. Give me more time. Stall them. Stall the council. Don't be ridiculous. Your investigation is over, Garrus. Commander Shepard, Garrus Vicarian. I was the officer in charge of the CSEC investigation into Saren. But who was that? Just talking to? That was Executor Palin, head of Citadel Security, my boss. He'll be presenting my findings on Saren to the Council. Come across anything I should know about? Saren's a specter. Most of his activities are classified. I couldn't find anything solid. But I know he's up to something. He's got a little like list. Say, I feel it in my gut. I think the council's ready for us, Commander. Good luck, Shepard. Maybe they'll listen to you. No, wait. I want to talk you to you more. Keep the council waiting. But you're the love of our life, probably. Who's that? Oh, it's Caden. <laughs> I already can say I like Dragon Age's like setup way more. The map, the way the characters are displayed on the screen when they walk with you, and their health. I mean, I'm sure they will be, I guess, during but uh, battle. But who are you? Wait, which way are we going? This way. This way seems probably. Probably good, right? Or did we come from there? Um. Oh, Garrus, where were you? Is that you walking? No, some red dude. Garrus, come back. Where's the council? Where am I supposed to go? It's very dark. They were like, focus all the light on the water. Focus it. But doesn't the player need to see? Yes, but focus all the light on the water. <laughs> to Presidium. Is that the wrong way? You sure have to climb a lot of stairs to reach the council. 
Oh. Okay, this... Symbolic. Thanks, Caden. Thanks for pointing that out. Man, she just gets to carry her weapons around. At least there's that. I'd be pissed if they were like, please hand over your weapons. No. Okay, so I was supposed to go this way. He said you gotta walk up all the stairs. I don't need the rapid transit. What is that? <laughs> Ashley, it's Ashley, everyone. It looks... I don't know what it looks like. It looks like a crab... A crab cabbage. A crabbage. Hearing's already started. Come on. Sorry. I got lost. I've never played this game before, Arbiter. The attack is a matter of some concern, but there is nothing to indicate Saren was involved in any way. The investigation by Citadel Security turned up no evidence to support your charge of treason. An eyewitness saw him kill Nihilus in cold blood. Yeah. We've read the Eden Prime reports, Ambassador. The testimony of one traumatized dock worker is hardly compelling proof. Really? I resent these accusations. Nihilus was a fellow Spectre and a friend. That just let you catch him off guard. Captain Anderson, you always seem to be involved when humanity makes false charges against me. Ugh. And this must be your protege, Commander Shepard. That's me. The one who let the beacon get destroyed. You're the one who destroyed the beacon, then you tried to cover it up. Shift the blame to cover your own failures. Just like Captain Anderson. He's taught you well. But what can you expect from a human? Saren despises humanity. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Your species needs to learn its place, Shepard. Whoa. You're not ready to join the Council. You're not even ready to join the Spectres. He has no right to say that. That's not his decision. Shepard's admission into the Spectres is not the purpose of this meeting. This meeting has no purpose. The humans are wasting your time, Counselor, and mine. You can't hide behind the Council forever. There is still one outstanding issue. Commander Shepard's vision. It may have been triggered by the Beacon. Are we allowing dreams into evidence now? How can I defend my innocence against this kind of testimony? Well, I agree. Our judgment must be based on facts and evidence, not wild imaginings and reckless speculation. Do you have anything else to add, Commander Shepard? You've made your decision. I won't waste my breath. Whoa! Hitler stash! The Council has found no evidence of any connection between Saren and the Geth. Ambassador, your petition to have him disbarred from the Spectres is denied. I'm glad to see justice was served. He looks evil! This meeting is adjourned. I mean, maybe the hologram doesn't help. Is he gonna jump? Well, that's it, everyone. <laughs> I did my best. He just jumped. It was a mistake bringing you into that hearing, Captain. You and Saren have too much history. It made the Council question our motives. I know Saren. He's working with the Geth for one reason. To exterminate the entire human race. Every colony we have is at risk. Every world we control is in danger. Even Earth isn't safe. Tell me about this history between you and Saren. I worked with him on a mission a long time ago. Things went bad. Real bad. We shouldn't talk about this here. But okay, I know sorry. what he's like. And he has to be stopped. We need to deal with Saren ourselves. As a Spectre, he's virtually untouchable. We need to find some way to... Hey, you know who I think that is? I think that's Riordan from Dragon Age. What about Garrus, that CSEC investigator? We saw him arguing with the Executor. That's right. He was asking for more time to finish his report. Seems like he was close to finding something on Saren. I don't trust them! Any idea where we could find him? I have a contact in CSEC who can help us track Garrus down. His name is Harkin. Forget it. They suspended Harkin last month, drinking on the job. <laughs> I won't waste nice. my time with that loser. You won't have to. I don't want the Council using your past history with Saren as an excuse to ignore anything we turn up. Shepard will handle this. 
You can't just cut Captain Anderson out of this investigation. The Ambassador's right. I need to step aside. I need to take care of some business. Captain, meet me in my office later. <laughs> They're gonna do Falcons it. Falcons probably get into Cora's den. It's a dingy little club in the lower section of the wards. Maybe there's another way to find evidence against Saren. You should talk to Barla Vaughn over in the financial district. Rumor has it he's an agent for the Shadow Broker. The Shadow Broker? An information dealer. He's Buys like sells secrets the to best the CGI. Day. I've heard Barla Vaughn's one of the top representatives. He might know something about Saren, but his information won't come cheap. You and Saren have a history. What happened? About 20 years ago, I was part of a mission in the Skillian Verge. I was working with Saren to find and remove a known terrorist threat. Saren eliminated his target, but a lot of people died along the way, innocent people. And the official records just covered it all up. But I saw how he operates. No conscience, no hesitation. He'd kill a thousand innocent civilians to end a war without a second thought. Killing innocents doesn't end wars. It causes them. Exactly. I know how the world works, Commander. Oh, Sometimes I'm just trying to back to you up, decisions. Arbiter. But only if there's no other way. Saren doesn't even look for another option. He's twisted, broken. He likes the violence, the killing. And he knows how to cover his tracks. Tell me more about the Shadow Broker. He's a necessary evil of galactic politics. Buying and selling information is a part of the game. And the Shadow Broker just happens to be the best player on the field. Always sells to the highest bidder. Well, an doesn't appropriate get name. In politics, doesn't pick sides. A simple system, but it works. He's not a threat to anyone, not directly. He's just a resource we can use, or she is. Or maybe they are. Nobody really knows. Is this going to be like Kingdom Hearts 2, where we have to, like, go or earn a bunch of money to appease that guy? Our ambassador doesn't seem to get along with the council. He's just frustrated. The council's always preaching that we need to be part of the galactic community. But for them, it's a one-way street. They want us to expand and settle unstable regions like the Skillian Verge and the Attican Traverse. But when we run into trouble, they don't want to help us out. Everyone knows it's only a matter of time until we get a seat on the council. The ambassador just thinks it should happen sooner rather than later. Fair. And I agree. Maybe they'd let us join the council if we were more willing to cooperate with the other species. Of course they would. If we did everything they told us to, they'd love to have us on the council. Well, but yeah. It wouldn't be much of a deal for us. Also I true. Understand their side. They don't want us dominating the council. It's founded on cooperation and alliances. But we have to look out for our own interests too. You don't think much of Harkin. The guy joined CSEC about 20 years ago. He's been an embarrassment to our species ever since. Roughing up suspects in custody, bribery accusations, alcohol and drug use. I was going to say, the drinking on the job. He used to step in when he got in trouble. But I guess enough was enough. The guy's a scumbag. He should have been cut loose a long time ago. He was one of the first human CSEC officers. Guess it would have looked bad if he got fired. A lot of <laughs> backroom deals were worked out over the years to keep him on the force. Ugh. Politics is a dirty business sometimes, but it looks like his time's run out. We've got enough humans in CSEC now to stop protecting him. I should go. Good luck, Shepard. I'll be over in the ambassador's office if you need anything else. I'll be over in the ambassador's office ripping off my head and revealing my true self, the Arbiter. Like, you know, like, like a mask. Ashley, what should we do next? This is where the council passes judgment on all this little folk, huh? Ever get the feeling ran over our heads, Commander? Well. We gotta find Garrus. Huh. What's this? Nothing. Can I can I walk off? No, in Dragon Age you could walk off. Hmm. 
Hmm, I thought it said like a like a chorbon. That's what I saw. Who are you? That guy's up to something. What guy? What? Oh no, I wasn't. Never mind. Hi. Um. Yes. Is there something you want? Oh my God, your teeth are horrible. Why are you so interested in the keepers? Keepers. I've got no interest in the keep. Don't get coy. I know what I saw. I, uh, I'm not so sure I should be talking to you about this. Just tell me what you're doing. I'm not here to get you into trouble. All right. I guess it wouldn't hurt to tell you. I'm using a small scanner to gather readings on the keepers. So far, I've had mixed results. I find it difficult to get near the creatures. Why were you being so secretive about it, though? Well, technically, we're not supposed to disturb the keepers. I don't really think my scanning disturbs them, but the authorities might disagree. I'd like to do it more openly, but it's not really worth getting arrested over. I can help you out. I'm not worried about the authorities. I don't even know who you are. I'm Commander Shepard with the Alliance Military. <laughs> Forget it! Hmm. Well, I, I suppose I could use the help. You'll need this. It's the scanning device I developed. Activate it each time you see a keeper. All collected data will automatically upload to my database. I'll even send a few credits your way for each unique scan. How are you doing? What are you doing with the data once you've scanned it? Trying to learn whatever I can about the keepers. We see them working everywhere, yet we know so little about them. I'm a scientist. I want to know what makes them tick. Cool. I should get going then. Yes, I have much work myself. I like Hello. him. And good luck with the scanning. Despite his weird teeth. Those, okay, those guys, uh, I don't know what the species name is called, because I'm terrible. I've forgotten all those species names except the Geth. Um, that guy, and there was a council woman who was the same species. They look like the, uh, the type of alien from Lilo and Stitch who was, like, the head of the army or whatever. <laughs> and if you watch my Kingdom Hearts series, you know I don't care for her very much. <laughs> Are we going? I forget if we're going somewhere. Are we going somewhere? We're going to find Garrus, but we have to use transport, do we? Aren't we going to the bar? <laughs> uh, sure. Cora? I don't know what that is, but we're going. I can't read it completely because of this stupid bar at the bottom of my screen saying, You're recording! Oh, Cora's den. Is it Chora or Cora? Because that's a cool way to spell Cora. That's her. Why do I have my gun out? Oh. I'm glad there's unlimited ammo. I mean, you gotta recharge, but. Got some gel. Ashley, you're getting your butt kicked, girl. Lady. I don't want to say girl. But eh. I say hey, girl, hey, and crap. I just think girl is like. Oh! Oh god! How do I heal? That's how. I forgot. <laughs> how did I get hit so. Open the door. I'm gonna die. Where are they coming from? Hi, Caden. <laughs> ah! We done? Can open the door? Oh! Yeah! Those were Saren's men. Negative contacts, Commander. Okay. Well, I guess now the door will open. Yep, it's green. Is this how I sprint? Nope, that's how you heal. Oh. Well. Oh, we're at a bar. Hi, Jenna. 
I have my gun drawn. You better talk to me right now. I got business here, but not with you. Whoa. Go away. I'm not interested in talking. Oh my gosh, we're, it's a strip club. The Citadel is wild. Not now. Watch the show. Back off, Rex. Fist told us to take you down if you showed up. What are you waiting for? I'm standing right here. This is Fist's only chance. If he's smart, he'll take it. He's not coming out, Rex. End of story. This story is just beginning. Out of my way, humans. I have no quarrel with you. <laughs> what was that all about? Who knows? Let's just try not to get caught in the middle. Sorry, I had to run in a complete circle before we could speak. Arkin! Hey, sweetheart, you looking for some fun? I no. I say, that soldier get up looks real good on that body of yours. Wow. Why don't you Great. sit your sweet little ass down beside old Arkin? Have a drink. We'll see where this goes. I'd rather drink a cup of acid after chewing on a razor blade. You trying to hurt my feelings? You gotta do better than that. After 20 years with CSEC, I've been called every name in the book, Princess. Just tell me where Garrus is. I'm looking for a CSEC officer, a Turian named Garrus. Garrus? <laughs> you must be one of Captain Anderson's crew. Who Correct. Are still trying to bring Saren down, eh? I know where Garrus is, but you gotta tell me something first. Did the captain let you in on his big secret? Just tell me where Garrus is before this gets ugly. But it's all related, don't you see? The captain used to be a specter. Didn't know that, did you? It was all very hush-hush. The first human ever given that honor, and then he blew it. Really? Screwed up his mission so bad they kicked him out. Of course, he blames Saren. Says the Turians set him up. You said yeah. they covered all this up. How'd you hear about it? I spent 20 years working cases here on the Citadel. People on this station love to talk. <laughs> Secrets are like herpes. If you got them, you might as well spread them around. Yeah, you're really gross. Cause like, first of all, even if the humans tried to cover it up, wouldn't the specters brag and be like, we're never letting another human in? Like. Noticed that now, did you? Why should I believe a drunk like you? Fine, ask Anderson. I bet he tells you. He's too stupid and proud to lie right to your face. Just tell me where Garrus went. Garrus was sniffing around Dr. Michelle's office. She runs the med clinic on the other side of the wards. Last I heard, he was going back there. What do you know about Garrus? Damn hothead is what he is. Still thinks uh -oh. he can save the world. Always bucking heads with the executor. He'll pay for it soon enough. The executor loves to put us lowly field agents in our place. Just look what happened to me. You need to look in a mirror. Sober up and take some responsibility for yourself. Yeah. Save your sermons. This ain't no church. Out of here. Yeah, good. Go. Let me drink a these. You're gross. I don't like you at all. Wow. Is there interspecies breeding in this? I'm just wondering. And I, I guess I shouldn't call it breeding. <laughs> that makes it sound like they're animals. But interspecies. Is there interspecies babies? Because I know as Shepard you can romance almost anyone you want. But obviously Shepard's not the first person to have relations with another species, I'm guessing. Obviously, I mean, those guys were watching the, the blue ladies dance. Wait, is this the Met Office? 
Might be. Hello there. Welcome to Moreland's famous shop. You want many good supplies, yes? Let me see what you have. Oh, you will be pleased, I think. Very good things I have. You will see. Oh, how much does it how much does it cost though? I can see how much I can sell it for, but Ooh, a sniper rifle. Wait, I don't, I'm under sell. Darn it! There's the cost. <laughs> Light armor. Eh. Sorry, buddy. I'm gonna continue looting people's bodies is what I'm gonna do. Garrus, where are you? Uh, I guess <laughs> I've gotten it right every time thus far. I mean, it's is C sec? No. Hey, where's? Excuse me. Welcome I need to, know to Presidium this. Tourism Terminal One. There are many points of interest here, including the Citadel Embassies and CSEC Headquarters. On the far end of this level, you can see the Citadel Tower, where the Council meets regularly to discuss yeah. matters of interstellar importance. I just want to know where... Huh. Goodbye. Goodbye, and thank you for using Avena. Shut Please up. enjoy your visit. Good day, Commander. The Human Ambassador is up the stairs, first room on the right. You know who I am? Yes, I receive reports on all newly arrived dignitaries and notable people. It, why does that computer thing exist if you're here? What is this place? What? This is the Presidium. More specifically, you are at the Citadel Embassies. If you have more questions, please access Savina. I should be going now. Have a pleasant day. Thanks for the codex, I guess. Oh dear, huh? So, uh, are you two into each other, or me, or are we all into each other? I'm happy you signed on with Commander Shepard. I'm not sure, Lieutenant. Every time I think I have a handle on things, the universe banks hard to port. Well, <laughs> don't let anybody know. A big gun and a confident attitude will get you through a lot in life. <laughs> the elevator music. They're having this intense discussion, and it's like, do 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 do. Can't move. We really have to sit through this. I don't care about this. Who cares about this? Sex seems more like a military operation than a police force. Oh, there we go. I found it. I was wrong, but still, I found it. Wait, there's an exclamation point. Oh, I think I have to go downstairs. Come here, exclamation point. 
This way? No, that is not isn't that like for transportation? We're gonna find out. Yeah, it is. Rude. Oh. There we go. There's a sprint. Wait, a keeper. Where's the keeper? I saw it. Yes. Woohoo! Oh, I saw another one of those earlier. Hey, I know you. You're Shepard, right? Sandal? I was at Mindwar during the Blitz. Saw you on the vids when you got your medal. You saved the whole colony. Looks Thanks. Like you have a fan. I'm sorry. I just never thought I'd meet someone like you in person. Uh, my name's Lang. Officer Eddie Lang, Citadel Security. It's an honor to meet you, Commander. What are you doing down here in the wards? Anything I can help you with? Uh, whatever this one I can't see is. Do you know a CSEC officer named Harkin? I shouldn't really say too much. He's been on the force a lot longer than me. But I've heard things, you know? Drinking on the job, taking bribes, that kind of thing. Rumors mostly, but they suspended him, so some of it must be true. What do you know about specters? Just the stuff they show in the vids. They always make him out the to vids. super agents on secret missions to save Please the Please put on the tally. I know it's not really like that, though. Some of the other CSEC guys don't like him too much. Figure they shouldn't be able to operate outside the law. But if they were so bad, the council wouldn't use them, right? <laughs> Why'd you join Citadel Security? I don't know. Seemed like the right thing to do, you know? Maybe it's in my blood. My grandfather was a cop back on Earth. It's kind of what CSEC is. Police for the Citadel. I'm still pretty new at it, but I like it so far. Way more interesting than staying back on Earth. You get to meet all kinds of cool aliens. Like those Hanar. Wild. Plus, CSEC gets a lot of respect here. We uphold the law. People, even aliens, appreciate that. Oh, really? I have to go. Right. You're probably real busy. Well, see you around, Commander. Bye, Sandal. No. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I don't want to talk to Officer Lang. I just want to go to the med bay. Emily Wong. What? Never been a real fan of crowds. Well, well, to med clinic. Oh, it's a scenic view. Wow. Look at that view. Never saw anything like that. This isn't a station, it's a city. There must be millions here. It can't be possible to track everyone coming and going. Sure, GPS. This makes Jump Zero look like a portage on. And it's the largest deep space station the Alliance has. Jump Zero is big. But this is a whole nother scale. Look at the ward arms. How do they keep all that mass from flying apart? Council represents more races than I thought. No wonder they're careful with newcomers. They probably just want to keep everything running. It has to be hard keeping all these cultures working together. Or maybe they just don't like humans. Why not? We've got oceans, beautiful women, this emotion called love. According to the old vids, we have everything they want. <laughs> you put it that way, there's no reason they wouldn't like you. I mean, us. Humans, ma'am. Wow. Don't take much shore leave, do you, LT? All right, enough chatter. Let's move out, people. Aye, aye, Commander. Aye, aye, Commander. Wait, what? Oh boy. I'm Emily Wong. I'm an investigative journalist working here on the Citadel. Could I have a moment of your time? What do you need? 
I've been hunting for evidence of corruption and organized crime on the Citadel, but there are places I can't go. I was hoping you might share anything you find during your own investigation. I can make it worth your time. How do you know that my investigation is going to uncover anything you need? Yeah. You wouldn't be investigating if it weren't big. And if it's big, it's something I'd like to hear about. How do you know I'm investigating anything here on the Citadel? I'm a good journalist, Commander Shepard. Word gets around. You gotta have access to better sources. Why contact me? I'm using every source I can find, but I think I've got a better shot with you. Book. I read your file. If anyone is going to uncover corruption here, it's the hero of the Skillian Blitz. Sounds like a good cause. If I find any information, it's yours. Thank you, Commander. You won't regret it. Okay, now we'll go to the bay. Welcome to the wards. Examine. The, I'm in the wards? To Flux. What's Flux? It's a game. I know that. Uh <laughs> I don't think you bought this here. I don't sell green I know what you oh. Hello, Earth Clan. I huh. doubt you've just come back from the colonies. Will you be needing supplies? What colonies are you talking about? Oh, my mistake, Earth Clan. I assumed it doesn't matter. Pharos? Novaria? Well, if you haven't heard of them yet, I'm sure you will soon. You remind me of a grunt. But it doesn't matter where you hail from. From Halo. My goods are available to all. Show me what you've got. Most excellent. I am sure you will find something pleasing. Uh. Oh my god. I'm going to save my money. Okay, I filed the green dot. Didn't work out. Are we not in the right place? Is that your Commander Shepard? The hero You're good looking. Eden Prime. I am so honored to meet you. Pleasure's nice all mine, to meet baby. You. And you are? My name is Conrad. Conrad Werner. They say you killed more than a hundred Geth on Eden Prime. I spent most of my time trying to stay alive and help the colonists. Yeah, dummy. Hey, I know you're probably busy, but um, do you have time for a quick autograph? Here you go. Thanks. I really appreciate it. My wife is going to be so impressed. Ah, oh, jeez. I'll let you get back to work. Oh, but next time you're on Earth, I'd love to buy you a drink. Thanks again. Whoops. The amount of question marks in my brain is outstanding, Conrad. More land. Who's that? You can keep the presidium. This is where the action is. <laughs> Are you more land? Well, oh. Hello there. Welcome to Moreland's famous shop. You want many good supplies, yes? Good. I've been here. Yes. All right then. Good tidings to you, human. <laughs> A human. What's that from? Oh, I don't want to go to Cora's den. I just want to. All right. A keeper. No, keeper. Keeper. Best 
place on this ward to buy upgrades. No, I'm good. I just want to find Garrus. Take me back to the med clinic. <laughs> Let's try again. I didn't tell anyone, I swear. That was smart, Doc. Now if Garrus comes around, you stay smart. Keep your mouth shut or Who are you? Let her go. Damn, it's hopping in the Citadel. I smell trouble. Oh, jeez, I don't even know where I am. This whole time, I thought we were fighting triangles. These flying triangles. Oh my God. Woo! Any more? Oh, yep. Oh, that's the door. Listen, I'm. Not at all. Okay, you guys got the rest? Woo! How about that? Hey, baby. Perfect timing, Shepard. Gave me a clear shot at that bastard. Uh, I think it's this nice shot. You took him down clean. Sometimes Woo! you get lucky. Dr. Michelle, are you hurt? No, I'm okay. Thanks to you. All of you. Why were they threatening you? Who do they work for? They work for Feast. They wanted to shut me up. Keep me from telling Garrus about the Quarian. What Quarian? A few days ago, a Quarian came by my Saren? office. Saren? No, She'd the Quarian. Shot, but she wouldn't tell me who did it. I could tell she was scared, probably on the run. She asked me about the Shadow Broker. She wanted to trade information in exchange for a safe place to hide. Then what? I put her in contact with Fist. He's an agent for the Shadow Broker. Fist? Not anymore. Now he works for Saren. And the Shadow Broker isn't too happy about it. Fist betrayed the Shadow Broker? That's stupid even for him. Saren must have made him quite the offer. That Quarian must have something Saren wants. Something worth crossing the Shadow Broker to get. What else can you tell me about the Quarian? I'm not sure. Like I said, she wanted to trade information for a place to hide. She didn't... Wait a minute. Geth. Her information had something to do with the Geth. She must be able to link Saren to the Geth. There's no way the Council can ignore this. Time we paid Fist a visit. This is your show, Shepard. But I want to bring Saren down as much as you do. I'm coming with you. You're a Turian. Why do you want to bring him down? I couldn't find the proof I needed in my investigation, but I knew what was really going on. Saren is a traitor to the Council and a disgrace to my people. Welcome aboard, Garrus. You know, we aren't the only ones going after Fist. The Shadow Broker hired a Krogan bounty hunter named Rex to take him out. Yeah, we saw him in the bar. A Krogan might come in handy. Last I heard, he was at the CSEC Academy. What's he <laughs> doing there? Fist accused him of making threats. We brought Rex in for a little talk. If you hurry, you can catch him at the Academy before he leaves. Move out. Oh! How do I pick? Oh, add to squad X. Accept. Sorry, Caden. All right. This concludes part th two. Part two. <laughs> part two. This concludes part two. Thanks so much for watching. It's been uh, it's been an interesting adventure. But uh, yeah. I'm into it.